hello. It is XO Ashley Pink, otherwise known as Ashley. And today I am filming my 20, uh, January 2021 bullet journal setup. So I'm going to be using this lovely kit from Erin Floto. Um, this I actually got in her Patreon, I will show you. I am her highest tier Patreon. So I got one of these. I believe that it's just like an extra. It has purchased, received, brainstorm, gift tracker. Um, and then this has like the dates, some mail, some checklist stuff, top three. I got two of them for some reason. This has a bunch of different icons on it. Some washi strips, challenge of the month, happy memories, self care, some other tracker things, planner time, workout. Um, Monday through Sunday and also a weekend in case somebody prefers weekend and then you have other ones and then this dates different headers so habit tracker gratitude finances daily summary uh, cleaning tracker brain dump mood tracker monthly goals and monthly review um, some washi strips some other kind of washi strips and headers and some deco this also came with this habit tracker um, these fun things so this is different like winter stuff and new year's stuff. And then this with this nice foil, it's like a really pale green foil, it's really pretty. Happy holidays, holiday countdown, hope family, celebrate, celebrate joy, workout, self care, and then daily stuff as well. Um, I also This is also Erin Floto, I got this on her website. Uh, I, I got it recently actually. And it has the months for 2021 and the days so you can use it as like, um, a tab and then I also got this it's a pre filled in one you guys know that I use these for my um, bullet journal the stencil and I really struggle with the stencil sometimes so I thought I would get one of those I also have this stencil but it like goes with this so if this works out I'm gonna be going through what kits of hers I have today's actually um, boxing day um, and I'm gonna be making lists for boxing day sales so yeah I'm really, really excited to start using this bullet journal. And I'm really excited to start doing getting it ready. I will see you in the, oh, this is sideways. There we go, that's a bit better. See you in the time lapse. calendar I forgot I had the mini calendars and that I was gonna do a, a page on that but yes I have that I like how I put the deco around here I had a calendar sticker so I put that there um, and for a quote for January put in a world where you can be anything be kind master task list of course I haven't filled this out but I usually put the holidays here what's coming off each month here and then things to do daily summary just a quick word on how each day has been I'm using this for my habit tracker and I'm gonna decide I think since bullet journaling planning 
and my period I know I think what I'm going to end up doing is what each thing means for my workout and for insta so that means nothing nothing under five five to ten and fifteen plus um post and story just a story or just a post there then I have my mood tracker cleaning tracker I thought I forgot that it was an annual cleaning tracker and that I was going to use it with my um in my bullet journal for like annual cleaning so I just did that really quick for check off with things challenge of the month I do want to plan to do with my um, um moxie life um uh, monthly planning like monthly um, writing prompts so I think this is gonna be like challenge like what kind of monthly writing prompts monthly goals so things to do with my moxie life that I'm doing and then a monthly review which are just write a little bit of a paragraph of how the month went and happy memories of the month my finance tracker I didn't use my um, ruler I wanted to try to use the trick that um, Amanda Rachley did which is where she just slowly pulls things towards her of course I knew that wasn't gonna work for me because I have an essential tremor so my hands move around um, but I tried and it's really wobbly and I'm not sure if I like it but it's something new <laughs> and I have a couple pages of that my brain dump gratitude and gift tracker I wanted to do that because it came with it to see what I got for Christmas and then I did a one page weekly that has just enough space for like what I usually write in the run of a day, um, a to-do list for the week, and then some three priorities for the week. And then I included the Hydra tracker because it was there. So yeah, this was a total of, see I'm trying to minimize the pages that I use. So this is a total of one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten pages back to back. Whereas in my other bullet journal, I'm going to take this one and see what my December one was. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen 11, 12, 13 pages back to back. So I did minimize it by a couple pages. Um, not totally, of course, but by some. Um, I never thought I'd get to a point, but, you know, like, this is my January, and this is what I have left for the month, so, pretty decent, but I like it, and that's my January in my bullet journal. I do have some stuff, such as these icons, these, and then I think some of this stuff that I'm going to just put to the side. And actually, I'll do it now. Um, I'm just going to pop these back here in the pocket. And then when I do my monthly ace, I'll pop them out. And that's something I can use for that. So yeah. If you like this video, please give a share, like, thumbs up, and all that have a blue. And I will see you later. Bye.